Look at those EKG strips. Intimidating, right? Well, first you have to know what is an EKG, and then you have to figure out the breakdown of an EKG. Don't worry, I'll let you know. By the end of this video, you'll know all of that. Keep on watching. This is an EKG strip. Basically, an EKG is like a picture of the heart's electrical activity. Now I'm going to tell you the components of this EKG strip right here. So this is the P wave, and then you have the PR interval. You have the QRS complex, the ST segment, and the T wave. So now let's go over what each component means. So what I did here was break it down into pieces. So the P wave, the QRS, and the T wave. The P wave is basically the contraction of the atrium, also known as atrial depolarization. The atrium will push blood down into the ventricles. So when you think of that, you wanna think of the heart, the blood flow through the heart, it goes from the right atrium down to the left ventricle, so on and so forth. The next thing you have is the QRS complex. The QRX complex is also called ventricle depolarization. And what that means is, is when the ventricles are squeezing the blood out. And then we have the T wave. The T wave is ventricle repolarization. And remember, re repolarization means relax. So the ventricles are now relaxed. And let's talk about the PR interval. It represents the passage of impulse through the AV node. Normal is 0 0.12 to 0 0.20 seconds. And then the ST segment represents early ventricular repolarization. So when the ventricles are relaxing early. 